Hey, how are you? My name is Emilio. Thank you so much for joining me today. You've got yourself some AirPods or some AirPod Pros and we wanna get them working on your computer, on your PC. We're specifically looking here at Windows. We're doing this on a Windows 10 computer. Now, the great thing about the AirPods is that they are Bluetooth, so they will work very, very well on Windows-based computers that are running Bluetooth. So let's look at that right now. Please subscribe, click on that bell so that you don't miss out on anything as well. I release a heap of tech videos every week, so hopefully you find some of these future videos also helpful. All right, so because these AirPods are Bluetooth, it'll work on any device, on any computer that is Bluetooth compatible. Now you may have an iPhone and you've got them paired already to your iPhone and that process was very, very easy. It's a little bit more complicated on a Windows computer, but it still will work really, really easily. So let's log into my Windows computer right now and show you how to pair our AirPods to our computer. All right, so logged into our Windows 10 computer, you of course wanna have your AirPods handy. And of course, this is connected over Bluetooth. So on our computer, on the very bottom right-hand corner in the taskbar, you've got some hidden icons right here. And then you've got a Bluetooth icon right there. Now, if that doesn't show up for whatever reason, you can go into the search area right here and type in blue. You'll see that Bluetooth and other devices is showed up. All right, and then we can just select add Bluetooth or other device. We go right into there. We're gonna select Bluetooth from our list and make sure your device is turned on and discoverable. So this is where you now get your actual AirPods themselves. And on the very back of the AirPods, you've got a big round button. So you're gonna go ahead and push that button and hold it. And then what you'll see is that that AirPod should now show up in the list. So headphone audio, it then will then find it. And it's actually seen that it's called Emilio's AirPods Pro. So if you've given it a meaningful name, it should show up right there. If it doesn't, that's okay but it's just a little icon of a headphone right there. You click on it, it'll say connecting. Essentially, it's now trying to establish a connection from your Windows 10 computer to your AirPod Pros. If everything has worked correctly, it'll now say your device is ready to go and it is now connected. Now, if for whatever reason, the actual AirPods themselves have not connected correctly or you weren't able to get them working at all, you'll have to just repeat that process again. I sometimes find that you may have to take the AirPods out of their case, put them back in, repeat the process, sometimes holding the button on the back slightly longer than other times, but then eventually it should then all work. Once the AirPods say paired on the actual computer, you can then click on connect. You'll hear a nice little chime coming out of the AirPods and that confirms that they are connected. And then the AirPods should work. Now, if they don't work for whatever reason, something else that you can try is going to sound settings and under the choose output setting, you'll see that by default, it has the speakers from your computer. It also will have your headphones listed in there for the output and also the same thing for your input. So there you have it. The AirPods should now be working. If they didn't, let me know in the comments and maybe we can help you out further. But if you did like this video, like it, give me a thumbs up as well. Click on that subscription button and on the bell so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. And do also check out some of those other videos that I'm also releasing. Thanks again for spending the time. We'll see you next time.